Hey everyone, welcome back. Today, we're diving into some of the best free software for bringing your stick figure characters or any animation to life. I'm gonna walk you through each one and explain who they're best for and what skill level you need to get started. So, this isn't just a simple software review. This is your chance to find the perfect free tool that fits your style and experience level. All right, no time to waste. Let's jump into it. The first one up is Pencil 2D. This one's super simple and super useful, especially if you're looking to make frame-by-frame -frame animations. It's got a super easy interface, supports both vector and bitmap graphics, comes with all kinds of drawing tools, and has a super easy layer system. Plus, you can scale and rotate things without any hassle, and it supports audio files too. It's perfect for people who already have some drawing skills, and once you get the hang of it, you can start cranking out amazing animations pretty quickly. If you're someone who doesn't care about fancy features and just wants to animate using your own skills, Pencil 2D is awesome. It's basically a super easy platform for animators to put their skills to the test. No distractions. Great for beginners who want to get their feet wet in animation. Next up, we've got Pivot Animator. If you're looking to create simple, quick stick figure animations, this is a great choice. The interface is super straightforward, so you'll be up and running in no time. You can create your stick figures and easily animate them by connecting parts like arms, legs, and heads. It gives your movements a nice, smooth flow. One feature I absolutely loved is that you can download tons of characters, backgrounds, and tools straight from the Pivot website. There's a huge library of free stuff, which is amazing. From my own experience, you can make really cool animations super fast with this software, and it's perfect for beginners. But if you want to get more creative or professional with your animations, you might need to move on to other software eventually. But if you're just getting started and need something simple, Pivot Animator is awesome. Now let's talk about OpenTunes. This is a more professional but still free option for making 2D animations. This is a huge step up if you want to create more polished, professional animations without spending any money. If you're into stick figure animations, OpenTunes is a great tool to help you level up. This software is way more than just a frame-by-frame -frame animation tool. You can think of it like the free version of Adobe Animate. It supports a bone rigging system, so you can connect different parts of your character and control their movements in a more natural, precise way. You can also add lighting and color effects to your scenes, things like sunlight, shadows, and special color effects to really make your animation pop. It's also got great tools for syncing sound with your animation, and you can use filters to enhance your image quality. The X Sheet feature helps you organize and time your frames perfectly, so it's definitely a great option for both beginners and pros. If you're looking for a free, powerful tool to build your animations from scratch, OpenTunes is a fantastic option. It might take a bit to learn, but it's totally worth it. Number four, Synfig Studio. If you liked OpenTunes, you'll probably like Synfig Studio too. You could think of Synfig as the free version of Moho. It has many of the same features like bone rigging, automatic frame generation, and tools for making more complex animations. It's super useful for creating more advanced animations. One of its coolest features is that you can make frame-by-frame -frame animations without having to draw each frame by hand. The software automatically fills in frames for you, so you can work faster and get smoother animations. It's perfect for anyone looking to make more complex animations without having to draw every single frame. That said, it's not without its flaws. The software's been around for a while, but doesn't get updated much, and there's not a lot of tutorial content out there to help you learn. The interface is a bit complicated too, so it might be a challenge for beginners. If you're a more advanced animator looking for a free tool that can handle complex animations, Synfig is a solid choice, but if you're a beginner, I'd recommend holding off on this one for now. Number five, Krita. Next, we've got Krita, which is a super popular choice, especially for digital artists. While Krita is known for being an amazing drawing tool, it's also got all the features you need for 2D animation. 
It's got a ton of tools for sketching, inking, and coloring, making it great for those of you who care about creating beautiful, detailed animations. If you're someone who loves making stunning, professional-looking animations, Krita's definitely worth checking out. The software is all about making your designs as precise and beautiful as possible. You can create gorgeous environments and backgrounds for your animations, and it's totally capable of handling frame-by-frame -frame stick figure animations too. It might take a bit longer to learn, but if you're into making beautiful animations and want a professional level tool, Krita's a fantastic choice. And last but not least, we've got Blender. It's one of the most powerful free animation tools out there, and it's used by professionals for both 2D and 3D animation. The crazy thing is, even though Blender is mostly known for 3D modeling and rendering, it's actually amazing for 2D animation too. Blender uses something called Grease Pencil, which lets you create frame-by-frame -frame 2D animations just like you would with a traditional pencil and paper. It's perfect for stick figure animations because you can design characters and separate each body part into different layers so you have total control over each movement. Blender also supports rigging and bone-based animation, which is perfect if you want to make more complex animations. The learning curve is a little steep, but trust me, it's worth the effort. Blender's got a massive community, so there's a ton of free resources and tutorials out there to help you learn. If you're serious about making 2D or 3D animations and don't mind putting in some time to learn, Blender is definitely one of the best options. It might be a bit tricky for beginners, but once you get the hang of it, you'll be able to create some amazing stuff. So that's it. I hope this video helped you find the perfect free software for your animations. Like I said in my previous video, it's not about the software, it's about your skills. With enough practice, you can create amazing stick figure animations in any of these tools. If you have any thoughts, suggestions, or feedback, drop a comment below. I'd love to hear what you think. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.